There's an extreme deficiency in gas and fuel, with addition to a deficiency in home gas cylinders. This crisis has reached its greatest impact today and is evident through the extreme scarcity of fuel. What is the cause of this crisis and when will it end? Syria needs 136,000 barrels of oil daily in order to cover the population's minimum daily needs. But why is the country unable to provide this today? International political negotiations have found that the end to the Syrian war depends on several criteria, including the expulsion of Iranian forces, which include more than 100,000 fighters. After many stages of negotiations regarding this issue, Iran refused to expel its forces and militias and instead began several movements, the most important of which being a meeting between the Iranian chief of staff and that of Syria and Iraq in Damascus. This caused concern in political negotiations and led to some participating countries to increase their blockades on Syria. Adhering to the economic blockades prevents oil products by both water and air routes in order to force the removal of Iranian forces and militias from Syria, in order to prevent these products from reaching them. The Syrian people, who have faced the harshest consequences of the blockade, will continue to suffer due to the lack of oil and the deficiency of food, including wheat, rice, and sugar. Thus, will this crisis end with the removal of Iranian forces and militias from Syria?